The main generator also has a start winding in it. It's used to start the locomotive diesel engine. So you have um, a set of windings that actually turns this into a big electric motor to turn the engine. Then once it's fired, it turns into a generator. This main generator will put out 600 volts DC and approximately up to 2000 amps. Generally, you don't run that high. Uh, it produces just DC voltage only. The newer locomotives have alternators and they use uh, SCRs to invert it back over to DC. This generator here is specifically for this locomotive only. That's all it does is it powers up the traction motors, which moves the train down the track. And then this is the load regulator. It regulates how much voltage this puts to the traction motors depending on load and speed. So that runs off the uh, oil pressure in the engine. This up here is the auxiliary generator. Up here, there's a fan motor to cool the main generator. This is an auxiliary generator. This recharges the battery and runs all your lighting and equipment in here. All the equipment, uh, fans, blowers, lights, everything's at 72 volts DC. This unit right here is the reverser for the locomotive. It reverses the DC motors so that it can uh, go forward and backwards. It is real simple, but it's been in operation since the, like I said, the late 40s, early 50s, and it's still the same unit. It's amazing how well they built them. But those are the power contactors to bring the power into the traction motors that you're looking at right there. Power contactors and the bottom one's reverser. Yes, that does rotate. It has uh, air cylinders on it that rotate it uh, each direction. So as it comes in, it will turn it half a turn, and as it turns the other way, it turns it the other, another half a turn. And the traction motor is uh, attached to the wheel set there. They call them a combo. Okay, this traction motor is a D78 traction motor. It is uh, DC. It has uh, just field and armature windings. Um, it is attached to a gear case, which runs the uh, axle that runs through the middle and turns the wheels. It runs on up to 600 volts DC from the main generator, and it weighs 12,500 pounds.